Some of our customers have been having trouble using the telepresence feature with RoboMe. So before I get started, let's make sure we have all the necessary materials. For starters, RoboMe's face can be an iPhone 4 or Plus and that will be sufficient. However, if you are trying to use telepresence, then the corresponding iOS device that will launch the controller app must be iPod, iPhone 5 Plus and iPad 3 Plus. Once you have ensured that you are using the proper devices, make sure you have a strong internet connection and make sure both your devices are connected to the same network. Once you have ensured that you are using the proper devices, here is what you do. First of all, make sure both apps are completely up to date and that you have the latest versions. The next thing you have to do is sign into both devices with the same Facebook or email account. If you are signing in using Facebook, make sure that in the settings of your both iOS devices, your Facebook account is connected. So I'm going into my settings, I'm finding Facebook, and I make sure that all my information is punched in properly. If however, I'm going to use email, and for the purpose of this video I will be doing that, make sure that you're signing into the same email account on both your iOS devices. Now that I'm signed into both devices, I am prompted on my other iOS device to find my iPhone. I highlight it, select it, and press the check mark. Once I do, the video will get started. And as you can see, I popped up on both devices and I can now take control of my robot.